So, hello guys, today we're back with another video and I'm really, really excited. You want to know why? Because first off, I got this from Crazy Ben. $10. $10 freaking dollars, right? You know? Nice. Very cheap. And we're going to see if they're very good quality or not. So my name is Cookie and I present you the One Must K2 Pro High Professional Gaming Professional Gaming Headset. Why do they have? I'm not joking. That's actually what it says and I don't think you guys can read that. So let's open it. Let's just look at the box first. Here's the back. Front. Side. Other side. The bottom. And the top. We're just going to go. It's a nice one of these. Right? So. You know? So. We got. Looks like. The headset. And then we got the manual. So. The box is completely empty other from that. Nothing else. So what we're going to do is just look at the user manual. It's a flip book. It shows you what's what and things like that. You know. I missed the page. Just like that. So we're gonna just shove them back to the box, and here's the final reveal. Okay, then, 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 um, came with the plastic bubble wrap, which, if you don't mind, nice. Oh, you can't tell me that's a nice sound. So we're just gonna put that back in here. So we're gonna just go look at this first. So we got the adapter. Um, a USB plug, right? And then we have our volume control, where you have our dial up and down, like you know, sound quality. And then you got your mute button right here. After all, from that we got the headset. It's nice and bulky, and it it, it fits really nice around my head, and. It's already adjusted. That's not a very good sign because that normally means it's open. And it's a very nice. It's very nice. It is very, very nice. So we have the mic. It, it, it's, listen to this. It's kind of satisfying, but yeah, it's also kind of hard. And if you're just like pulling it from here down, it's gonna mess with the mic. Um, it is a mic. It is bendy, right? bendy wendy, and then if I'm going to, I'm just going to plug it in, uh, oh, well, there's an adapter, so here's the adapter, nothing, you know, fancy, we got green, I think, for headset, and then red for mic, you know, that's that. Let's go we'll look at the light first. So it comes with a nice little protector case. Comes off very nice. Made a very, very nice sound. So we're just gonna. Oh, I did I toss it there. So we're going to be using this power bank. It's power add. It's a very good, reliable one. It's very nice, very good quality. Everything's very nice about it. Beside that, here this is the gaming headset. So as you can see, you got your mic and you got your headset around there, which does travel through there, which is very very nice sometimes. Because when you're just you know playing in the dark, nice. And then you got your obviously your mic right there, because that that's obviously a necessity. Same with this side, kind of the same thing inside. Now we're gonna go plug in for the audio. So I'll be right back from that test. Okay. I uh, I'm not joking. Holy guacamole! These, these, bro. I'm speechless. 
compared to every single head that I've compared to. I've had these, uh, these are my brother one. I push up for that, right? They sound crispy nice. There's no input leg or anything. And when I was playing with my friends, guess what? The, it just came straight in, straight out. And the mic, they said, it was way better quality than my other headset. And so it's safe to say I'm going to give it 7 out of 10. Just because I forgot to mention that the cushion, it, it doesn't really cushion your head. It, it feels nice, right? Now I just completely, completely broke it. Okay. It feels nice. It's just that when you put it on your head, for me, it's kind of just dagging. It's not very, like soothing compared to my other headphones which were a lot more thicker and nicer but overall like 9 out of 7 out of 10 it's 9 or 7 out of 10 because the thing is it's just like <laughs> but my brother's just like boom, boom, boom. Okay. it's just like it's you know overall you're getting these for 40 30 bucks and so you're, you're gonna obviously not gonna have like an Astro A50, right? Or things like that. So they're not gonna be as nice, but if you're just talking about the general price range out of all of them, I, I would give this a seven or nine out of 10. And then we're just gonna say out of 10, cause you know, I can't decide on that. So I'm gonna see you guys later. Um, I think you can buy this from Amazon or Crazy Bins. So see ya. Have a great day, Cookie Farm family.